Sobriety is underrated, man. I'm all about the necessary, and I'm all about going hard or going home. So if you're getting high and you're not off the crack rock, I gotta worry about your commitment to the cause. My boy DMX hit the pookie and went platinum. I don't know if the Amish are rated at all. I don't trust the Amish. They got iPhones. They don't have black Amish people. They got black Amish. They have like Puerto Rican Amish. I will never be Amish. It's not my movement. You know, let them have that. We always try to steal some shit in America, man. We're taking people oil, we took Playstations. Let, you know, let people be. I'm not putting on that stupid ass hat. KFC is overrated. Fuck the Colonel. Fucking asshole, he's a slave owner. Bill Nye is underrated, man. Bill Nye is the reason all these kids know how to proportion their lean in their beverage. He taught us these algorithms. Very underrated. Is he dead? Lobsters are underrated. They don't die. You have to kill a lobster for it to die. You think I'm fucking around, don't you? Look at my face. Do I look like somebody who doesn't know what they're talking about right now? Oprah underrated, man, because people forgetting she got that trash-ass broadcast network. And she founded Dr. Phil and some other people, probably Dr. Drew, probably Beats by Dr. Dre. Tom Cruise is underrated. Why? Because the mission was impossible. And he pulled it off. <laughs> Three times. <laughs> Fuck all that keeping the real shit, man. Just be yourself. You might be a fake ass nigga. If you a fake ass motherfucker, you're not keeping it real by being real. But what's real? Because, like, you know, some people are just not real. And we know they know. But we got to act like we don't know that they know that we know. But at the end of the day, they know that we know that they know that we know. And they pretend that they don't know. Cyberbullying is overrated, man. You want to be mean to people, go gangbang. Get, get shot in your fucking ass. Bullying fat people, man. Fat people are lovely. One of my grandmas is fat. Love her to death. So you bullying fat people on the internet, you're bullying my grandma, I'll fuck you up. I don't fuck with Peter. I've never seen Peter say one animal. Peter worried about fur and shit. This nigga's gunning down rhinos. Tell Peter to save a fucking rhino. Stop worrying about what somebody wearing. They out here dead. It's no more rhinos. I think, I think either all the white ones are gone or all the black ones are gone. What if, what if all the rhinos just killed all the white or black people? We'd be mad as fuck, right? <laughs> Pet ownership is very over. It's jail. People be hitting their animals and shit. And they wonder why pit bulls start eating motherfuckers. So, like, okay, you keep kicking me, I'm gonna eat your fucking baby. Only white people treat animals like people. But we think they're crazy, but they got the right idea. Give them a bed, you know, give them some toys. Fuck it, if you wanna really be cool, give them a house. You got a tumbler? Look up fancy dog houses. They got two stories, swimming pools in them. Exactly, people know how to treat these fucking animals. But I guarantee you, if you, get, if you put a pit bull in a two-story with a little dog elevator or something nice like that, it'll never touch a child. You feed my nigga kibbles and bits and slap him with a newspaper, he gonna go rogue one day, 